Another way you can help, Bridge to Home, we talked about them last week. Their uh, facility had, I think, a water leak and they had to move out. And we are going to uh, make a couple meals for them. We're going to make 60 sack lunches one day and dinner for 120 another day. And if you'd like to uh, donate to help us buy the food for that, we'd be very grateful. And also, we need four or five people to be involved and to help serve. So if you have any interest in that, check in the Connection Center. This Wednesday night is our last summer family fun night, Splash Bash. Um, we're going to have a hot dog meal. If you want to be a part of that, we'd ask that you'd bring a side dish or dessert to share with us. We're going to have a water slide, games on the lawn, lots of stuff going on. So hope you get a chance to be here as our sort of uh, unofficial end of summer. And then the next Wednesday night, September the 4th, we begin our Wednesday night program. This year we're calling it Taste and See. 6.30, we're going to have dessert and uh, some fellowship time. And then from 7 to 8, we'll have classes for uh, all ages. So I hope you are ready to get back into the Word. And if you are, there's another way for you to do that. We're going to start a new Bible study on Sunday, September the 22nd. It's going to be between the first and second service, about 9.10 to 10. It's called Unforgivable, How God's Forgiveness Transforms Our Lives. Uh, it's going to be a great class. If you want to be a part of it, please sign up by September 8th so we can have all the proper materials. And then last, uh, the Santa Clarita Valley Pregnancy Center is having their Walk for Life, big uh, fundraiser and awareness that they do every year. It's going to be Saturday, September the 28th at 9 o'clock at Crossroads Community Church. Uh, if you're interested in that, I'm sure we have more information here in the Connection Center and all. And uh, it seems like that's a lot of stuff. But there's more? There's more. <laughs> but wait, there's more. Um, so the big thing is, on that same day is the Walk for Life, okay? So Walk for Life is the morning, and in that uh, afternoon, noon to five, we're going to be having our Heavenly Classics car show. And this is like an all-hands-on-deck kind of a thing. We'd love for everybody to, to stand up and to serve, right? We talked about living in light of the eternal. This is a way to do it, man. Um, so that's going to be on the 28th from 12 to 5. Um, so if you want to help participate in that, there's all sorts of ways you can do it. You can use the app. You can use the website. You can head out to the Connection Center. Um, but also, one other thing with that, uh, we have uh, changed the, uh, the nonprofit that we're helping. So we were talking with uh, Bob Levy, who is both the leader of Foster All and another nonprofit called DadCon, which is all about uh, having fathers more present and with their kids in the home, kind of hoping that this could uh, help alleviate a lot of the situations they deal with with foster all and because it's a little bit newer and talking to him about just between these two uh, we're switching our our support group to, to dad con so if you want to learn more about that nonprofit you can talk to us that way oh father con thank you not dad con father con thank you um, and so they have all sorts of interventions they do to help dads be more present in the home uh, it's a really really awesome group uh, and then also the next day uh, on Sunday the 29th, we're going to have our outdoor picnic. If you come in here at 10 a.m., you're going to be super confused because nobody should be in here. There should be everyone outside. Uh, there's going to be a picnic and games afterward. If you're worried because you're like, oh, it's football season, I don't want to miss the game, they'll be on, on the screens. Don't worry. Uh, we'll, we'll make it work. It'll be all sorts of fun for the family. Uh, but with that fun comes a uh, need for some extra hands on deck for that as well. So there's all sorts of opportunities to serve. Uh, that